Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the first 3v3 match of the season for me. Uh, my opponent is Hobbs74. Pretty even match, 10.2 million. He does not have Sa uh, not Sa he doesn't have Afra, which is good. And he does not have like a super whale account, because he's missing plenty of stuff. No Zori. Um Tuscan Warrior. I mean he has the Zayas on it, but it's not very developed. Uh, Santa is gear 11, so uh, plenty of stuff missing. So should be an even match. Uh, and he already did his attacks, and he full cleared me. <laughs> um, he did drop a battle here on uh, Qui Gon Jin, which is great. Uh, that's not the team I'd expect to get a hold on, but I'm glad I got one at least. So I got my work cut out for me. Um, one shot down here, and the one shot in the back. The only two Galactic Legends I set were General for uh, Lord Vader and Jabba. Uh, Jabba's way easier to beat in 3v3. I don't know if Afra still does it in 3v3, but uh, Jedi Master Kenobi does it pretty well. And up here, uh, he said Dash on Chewie. I think he'll probably use Inquisitors there. I'm going to mirror Ray, but with Hoda instead of Holdo. Uh, JMK here. Uh, what am I doing there? Probably Wampa. Uh, Giant Revan. Bone Radis, maybe. He set one Galactic Legend on the bottom wall, which is Lord Vader. And then CLS. He's got Retribution uh, on these guys. So I don't know. Maybe they'll. Maybe I'll have some trouble with Aiden, but I'm still going to try it. Uh, the Malgus, which I think I can start killer this lineup. And then Grand Inquisitor, which I'll use Padme. Uh, but to start, I want to do Lord Vader. I think I'm going to go with this Datacron. It's an IG-11 Datacron. I'm not going to use an IG-11 anyway. It has Retribution for droids, which is nice. I would like to use that on droids, but I want the health and armor uh, for this. Because I don't have Super Datacron for Supreme or Kylo anymore. Um, and actually, now that I think of it, I want to bring Crew as well. Because I feel a little iffy about this battle. Because of Thrawn, I don't want him fracturing Supreme or Kylo. Just give the right tech there. And it's done. It's only R5, so... Not too much to worry about. Um, I don't want these guys to die, so I'm not going to give him a tech. Or, but I still just cleansed him off anyway. Pokey, probably. Oh, didn't die. Maybe I can keep them alive. So I'll go ahead and give it to him. He doesn't seem to be dying. Let me just poke here because I can get more siphon with uh the crit. Same for this, get some crits. Get to full. I'm going to cleanse it off him.
Try to cover some protection. He's hanging in there pretty good. Oh, I'm getting there. Can this do it? Almost. Dang, crew's hanging in there. I kept Watt and crew alive. Dang, it's awesome. 65. Wow. Was not expecting that part. Okay, that went well. Um, next, I want to do Imperial Troopers here. I've been a little antsy about this, but I know it's what I need to do. I need the turn meter front, uh, turn meter one with the droid bonus. Uh, I'll take the takes a bonus turn. Yeah, that one's probably better. And they got the weakest ally turn meter. Can't be revived, doesn't matter, but uh, this is going to give to bo -Katan, I think. And I think I should be able to... She's slow enough. I think I should be able to get enough turn meter when I pass with Dark Trooper. Got a full bridge. Yeah. And then give to you. And get full send. Oh my gosh, okay, three assists, that is... That works. I think he's gonna get some counterattacks. Okay, well that works. Uh, I just pretty much need a full clear in one shot, so I'll take that. Uh, Star Killer here. Where is he? There we go. It's like 97% on Swiggy.gg. And yeah, I think this is the one I like to use, but that's. Scoundrel Ally can't be revived. I'll use that with JMK. Um, droids? I don't think I need any droid revive prevention. Yeah, I don't think I need that. So let's do it. On these signs. I want to get to her. I remodded my Star Killer for pure health, so the what is it? The Star Destroyer should do a lot more than it has been. Don't want to chuck that thing. Okay, he's not going to assist. So that'll just heal him up if I check the thing. Yeah, that's not really doing much at all, man. Okay, let's see what this does. How much it does. Slow motion. That's very slow. 171. Just a couple more punches. I changed it to 4 speed and it still stays slow. 56. I guess someone had doubt or something. Why didn't they full heal? That's good. And now Inquisitors. I'm going to use Padme. All the way at the bottom. Yep, this. And I want one of these newer ones. 200%. I, I got a 200% potency data run. No rerolls. It's level 8. It's not even possible, but it's like crazy. I don't even know where to use it. Um, Rose? Resistance penetration. No, I want to save that for Ray. 
I don't know. I don't have much of the good ones left. I don't have much good data cards left at all, honestly. Resistance, that doesn't help. Potency, I like the health and protection recovery. Absolutely, well. No, I can't stun them. Dang, I don't know. Um, I'll just take this for the buff recovery. And we got this thing. Uh, 20 set turn meter. The super thing, the dispel. Uh, let's do it. Oh good, I got the courage. Uh, I want Ahsoka hang in there. Dang it. Well, she is hanging in there. the heal and protection up well great she's ability blocked come on give me a turn Not looking great. Oh, is that it? No, 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 one more. Okay, he's down. Stay alive, Ahsoka. Give her foresight, yes. Okay, whew. Just Padman Kenobi. There we go. That was too close for my comfort. Definitely. But we saved plenty for the back and the top. I don't know what I would have used there otherwise. It's a good team. And then I, I need a better data ground for that one, honestly. If I like if I had some health boosts, that would work. Much better. Uh, what am I doing here? I'm doing Iden. And... Dang, I'm getting low on stuff. Turn meter, don't need... Don't need the turn meter. Necessarily. Dang, it always sucks at the beginning of 3v3 when you're so low. Scoundrel takes a bonus turn. Get damage odds, protection, defense. 
Oh, go, go there for the extra offense. Do I have... What kind of scoundrels am I using? Bounty hunters. Um, yeah, I actually want to save that for bounty hunters. I gotta decide on this. Alright, so just went with a simple Terminator 1. It's got some survivability on it. Uh, going right at Luke. I'll get counters from both these droids. I would like the days in, but no. Come on, get the assist. Yes, there we go. The death mark on you. But he's gonna go. No, he's not. Okay, so uh, uh, retribution doesn't help a ton. If he had the level nine, that'd be a different story. I just rolled mine, but not in time for this match. So let's see what's in the back. Doesn't look like any Galactic Legends, unless one's under him. Okay. Maybe I'll use Grand Inquisitor there. Okay, not too much, so that's great. I'll have uh, plenty of Galactic Legends. I have four right now, and there's only two up top. So yeah, let me decide what I'm doing with all this. Uh, I guess Grand, I think Grand Inquisitor's there. I don't know. I'll have to figure it out. Alright, so I'm going to do the whole top wall first, starting with Jabba. Um, doesn't have much of a data crawling on him, just a level 3 with the turn meter gain. But I'm using JML, not JML, JMK. And I'm going to use the revive prevention so I don't even have to worry about Curse Santa in a second time. Uh, and I know I've done this a couple times, just in 5v5, whether Grand Arena or Territory War, but... This time I know this works. Um, it's just just three characters involved. Something to you. And he's gone for good, and then we just take out Boosh. Target my target himself because no assists. I forget that I can't swap turn meter if I'm not actually calling the assist to. Yep, one more. That's it. How much to it? The dispel. Ugh, I want the healing immunity, but. Gosh dang, dodged. The healing immunity, there we go, finally. Seven. So I guess he set three Galactic Legends total. I'm gonna use mine. Yep, and this is the lineup. And I want to do this. Yeah, health and protection recovery. The crit avoidance, critical chance, which is really nice because he has a very low critical chance. Uh, potency. I guess that helps. The stats are kind of spread out. I need to work on it, but. Yeah, what do they have? Yeah, the targeting thing. That's a pretty good one. Um, hopefully we can get some good whirlwinds in there. And be smart about all this. I switched her to offense. I kind of swapped her. And what is it? Uh, Oh yeah, who am I talking about? Uh, Starkiller. I swapped their mods. I shouldn't have... Let's 
Get rid of her. Okay. Uh, okay, that sucked. We're going to Ray. I gotta save that till after she does it. If I do it. Oh, we can't be revived. Oh, yeah, that's right. Um, I gotta stay above 50% so he can't die. Okay. Not the best banners, but it worked. I'm probably doing that wrong in a number of ways. Uh, so I will have to work on that if that's going to be my go-to counter this season. There it is. It's like, where's my Wampa? Um, unfortunately, I don't have super protection up one, but... I have two of the... No. Oh, yeah, health up. I'll just do this. next and just the dance with Kylo ah, it's annoying Can I do that the whole time I'm gonna have to ramp up a bit then Oh, no, we're not. There we go, 58. I will absolutely take that. And this one, just using Sith Eternal. They have the, <clears throat> not the, uh, turn meter cooldown reset on basic, but the bonus turn falling below 100% health. So Sith Eternal is actually very nice for this, because uh, you can zap them all the way to zero, and I don't need to have uh, super <clears throat> data runs for it. I don't think they can wipe them out. Okay, the damage threats are Dash and Han. And I'll just target Chewy. without the ult maybe so I can heal it all the way. Hmm yeah I don't think he's gonna survive. Can I dash no not gonna be not gonna be enough to heal up fully. Okay that's fine. 58 is good. 
And last one here. I'm gonna do Revan, Yoda, and Bastila. Yoda, Bastila. Self Grand Inquisitor. That potency. Actually, I might want that potency here. And a resistance penetration, too. Potency. I'll take resistance penetration. And resistance, because he does special damage. Start with her so I can get some buffs out. Then we mark him. Just want foresight. Just a Bastila. Get him one more time. I want Jin to take her turn, so she's not gonna revive him. Okay, now. Ah, oh, please don't bring him back, Jin. For some banner recovery. Don't kill him too fast. Mm, that is gonna... Well, he comes back. Is that enough? Yes, 57. Let's go. Nice. Let's see what's in fleet. Hopefully, no profundity. And ah, there's the profundity. Uh, now the question is, do I have the nerve to try... I, I'm comfortable with profundity against this. Do I have the nerve to try Executrix here? Because I can do that one now. Yeah, I might do it. Just to turn a new leaf. Uh, I don't know. Now time for the back wall. Okay, and starting with an easy one, I'm going to do First Order... Uh, Omicron versus this, and what do I want here? Uh, of the ones I'm, I'm gonna use Grand Inquisitor, that's what I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use CLS, JML, and Vader. So for each dark side, I can use one of these. Uh, they're all turn me to gain. This one. I'll use this one. That's fine. I don't think I need the turn meter gain. But it's not turning. Nice. Sweet. Actually, I, maybe I did need the Terminator gain. I didn't check speeds on Finn. Well, no, he's not really going to outspeed Hux. Um, and now... I'm do CLS on this Mon Mothma. With you. I'll put you in the second slot. There's 3P on Chewie. There. And what is this? Okay. So I get one of the light side ones. Oh, potency. Yeah, I'll take the potency. Nice. That potency actually is a good combo with this. I don't have much. damage at this point in time. Oh, 
Okay, <laughs> she's back. And they still resisted that blind. Nice. Nice and smooth, 57. I'm glad CLS didn't go to waste. Um, good for Newt. He had Grand Inquisitor pegged. So where are you? Um, can I leave? Can we end up ending up leaving a lot of stuff on the bench, like Bad Batch and Bounty Hunters? Um, but it just didn't work out for them to be the best use of stuff. So this one's pretty good. Mine's always pretty good. Got some good offense. Got some survivability. And here they got. I'll steal up. Nothing special. Some people have managed to lose this matchup uh, per Swigga GG, but not super concerned about that. Yeah, I want him ability blocked. Torture, Duke, it, or just kill him. some evasion. Remove the turn meter. Do this, and then I'll wait to do the heal. Um, second get everyone. It's almost there. What is going on up here? Okay, good. That counted. 57. Going well. Um, next up, I got Darth Vader tapped for this. Moff Gideon in a tank. Uh, Moff Gideon and this, yes. And that one I'll do. Okay. <clears throat> Yep, I'll remove the return meter. Possibly could have saved that. I think I was gonna steal banners. Did I dodge like all that? Oh, that's how it is. And now that wasn't enough. Full banners? Nice. 57. And then last but not least, Darth Revan I can safely overkill with Jedi. Uh, just these two? I'll bring her for some banner recovery. Buff thing. Okay. <laughs> After Sean first, get that buff on him. Only affects Shock T. Call sis, let's stun him. <laughs> Does nothing. Man. Must be so frustrating for Matt. Oh, I guess they have the tank revive. Must be frustrating for Matt to go against two people that aren't afraid.
and one guy that can't get force drained. Nice. 57. Cool, now I just gotta do ships. If I don't drop battles, even if I drop a battle, I might be okay. But the big thing is profundity. Uh, so I'm actually gonna look at the stats for what is just the highest percentage, and I'll probably just do that. Okay, so here's the thing with ships. The best counter for every fleet is profundity. Um, if you don't use profundity on this executor fleet, it's a much more iffy match than using like some kind of other counter on profundity itself. So I'm actually going to use, I'm going to grow a pair and use executrix. And I can do this now because my gauntlet is decent. It's over gear, they're over gear 12 and they're like just the right speed. So they work. Um, and then the only reinforcement you need is bomber. Uh, but I'm a chicken, so I'm going to bring in the interceptor as well. And that leaves me with a ragtag Empire Fleet. Uh, not an immediate reinforcement, but I if this works, I won't need them anyway. Uh, let me just check the 8 and 6. And I actually need someone to die. Relic 7. Okay. okay, yep, that's right. Let's just do it. I need someone to die so I can get the reinforcement. Hopefully that's just a TIE Fighter, but this works very smoothly um, as long as someone dies. And even though they go all, go all in on Scythe and he gets all the debuffs, he just cleanse away. They're very durable. So that's good. They're going after him. I want him to taunt. I'm going to use the basic. It's basic. Do we want those assists? Go ahead and do this. Let's see, I don't know. Come on, kill the TIE Fighter. Kill the dang TIE Fighter. No, don't go after him. Actually, don't want this guy to taunt. Okay, whew. That was lucky. So that AoE saved me. Bring in the TIE Bomber. And we should be good to go. Just use the basic. Uh, use basic again. <laughs> He's gone. Uh, and I'm going to heal myself with this. Almost killed him. And he just died. It was on a cord. Get this taunt up, which is nice. No turn meter, but that's, you know, that's how it is. I'm gonna force the taunt. Cleanse it up. And we're just golden. This is beautiful when it works. When it doesn't, it is sad and can be catastrophic. But this makes the rest of the match a breeze. I can actually average 55 banners, I forgot to mention that. I can average 55 banners uh, per ship battle and win, so that's another reason I felt fine to try this. And just gonna basically poke him and he's dead. Okay, there we go. 74 wins profundity, that's awesome. Now I can comfortably use Profundity on Executor and Executor on Negotiator. Use these two. Um, actually I'm going to use Cassian Ship. And go all out on IG. <laughs> nice, he's down already. Um, I'll save that. Nice, we got the stage there. That's actually really good. Because he's not assisting here. Oh my gosh, they're still going to get him? No. 
He survived. No, I don't need... I'm gonna just gonna do this for a little bit of health. Yeah, I'm fine with that decision. An alarm going off, sorry. turn because he was low on turn meter. Oh, and I got the buff immunity. That's great. Come on, man. Leave him alone. Okay, here we go. Nice. Just don't take any damage. Ah, that's a little bit of damage. Can I get some extra crits here? Nah, nah, nah. Well, he healed up right there. 75, nice. And now, Executor here. I'm gonna use standard lineup. That should be plenty. I'm hungry. It's 7.30 for me. Need to eat breakfast soon. Uh, click it. There. Come on, no marked. Uh, is this going to be annoying? Let's do it. Yeah, nice. Big hit. I targeted uh, Cad there because I wasn't guaranteed to land a breach. I don't know. And then, like, Cad can double tap even if there's not Breach. IG-11 needs Breach there. Um, so it's really just kind of a toss-up either way. Not super impactful. Ooh. That works. Get the ton up. Assist right now. It's nice that IG11 heals himself up. Oh, just finish. Just finish. Yeah, sure. Don't want any bombs coming out. Awesome, 72. So that was fantastic. Gonna get a really good score. 2073. Okay. I was not I don't remember exactly like what's a good score at the beginning of this season. So I saw 2016. I was like, oh, we got over 2000. I think that's pretty good. But I guess he dropped quite a few banners because he lost by 57. So that's almost like three drops, even though he dropped one. So my defense did actually do a good job. I was thinking it didn't do that great of a job. Uh, but just with one drop and still 57 points behind. So that's 37 banners more that he dropped than I did. 
uh, just on everything. So yeah, really happy with this one. It's great to come out the gate with a win. Looking forward to the next one. Uh, thanks for watching. See you later.